What's up, guys? Andrew Cayley from Covers back at you. And today I'm here to bring you my three favorite MLB player props for Tuesday, April 19th. And today we're going to wonder if Jose Ramirez can keep up this red hot start when we look at his total bases prop. Can a San Diego starter record a win? And is Robbie Ray missing his Toronto pitching coach now that he's in Seattle? And can we take advantage of it in his strikeout prop? Well, we'll start with Ramirez today, who is red hot. Uh, and we're going to take him to go over his total bases of one and a half when the Guardians host the White Sox. Ramirez sure seems comfortable ever since he's signed that new contract because the third baseman has been tearing the cover off the ball to start the season. He's hitting 457 with a 1386 OPS over his first nine games with three home runs, four four doubles, and a triple. And now he gets a familiar matchup against White Sox starter Dallas Keuchel. Um he is 7 for 22, um, which is a 318 batting average in his career when facing Keiko, which includes whacking four doubles off the lefty. Keiko is also coming off a disappointing year with the Pale Hose, where he logged a 526 ERA with a 153 whip and his 5.3 strikeouts per nine innings were his lowest since his rookie season all the way back in 2012. And his first start of 2020 was more of the same surrendering. Three runs on 6-6 six, six in just five innings. Mix in a White Sox bullpen that has struggled early on. And Ramirez looks like a great value to go over his total bases in this one, especially at the plus money we're getting. Next up is Joe Musgrove to record a win when the Padres host the Reds. Musgrove's, Musgrove has gotten his 2022 campaign off to a fantastic start, allowing just two earned runs on nine hits while striking out 14 in 12 and two-third innings of work so far. Now he gets a great matchup against the Reds since he has made it clear this offseason uh, that they were going to pass on being a competitive team this year, and we are seeing the results of that early on. The Reds are just 2-9, and nine, and the only team that scored fewer runs than them to this point in the NL is the Diamondbacks. But it's really been right-handers that have um, flum flummoxed the Reds' hitters. Uh, Cincinnati ranks 28th in the MLB when it comes to facing righties, righties hitting 176. And they rank dead last in OPS against righties at just 531. Meanwhile, the Reds counter with lefty uh, Reaver San Martin, who had a solid relief appearance against the Dodgers. Uh, but kind of got uh, thumped around by the Braves in his lone start of the year. Um, he's a soft off tossing lefty who doesn't strike out a ton of batters and the Padres have done a decent job against Southpaws this season ranking seventh in OPS all things considered uh betting on Musgrove to pitch well and earn the win tonight looks like good value and we close with Robbie Ray to go under seven and a half strikeouts when the Mariners host the Rangers you can make the case at least early on, that Ray maybe just uh, maybe misses his old pitching coach in Toronto, Pete Walker, because the Seattle, Ma Seattle Mariners starter has posted some troubling numbers in his first two starts of the season. The reigning AL Cy Young award winner has had some issues with his fastball early on. His velocity is down nearly three miles per hour. Uh, and opponents have an expected batting average of 300 on it so far. Uh, but maybe more troubling for Ray is his walk issues seem to have popped up again. After having a walk uh, percentage that peaked at 17.9% in 2020, Ray dropped that all the way to 6.7% last season. Um, but now that's popped back up over 10% in his first two starts this year. Um, and all that means is race strikeouts have been way down, recording just nine punch outs in, three, in 13 and a third innings. Uh, that's 6.1 strikeouts per nine, down from 11.5 a season ago. Now these numbers will return closer to the mean probably sooner rather than later, uh, but maybe not in this matchup against the Rangers. Texas uh, has a lineup full of big boffers, but they've been surprisingly patient at the ditch this season, striking out just 7.44 times per game. That's the sixth best mark in the majors. And they're also crushing lefties, ranking second with a 953 OPS and have struck out just 17 times in 91 at-bats when facing Southpaws this year. Bet on Ray to stay under his strikeout total in this one so guys to quickly recap we're going jose ramirez over one and a half total bases we're going with joe musgrove to record a win and robbie ray to go under seven and a half strikeouts make sure to like and subscribe and tune in tomorrow for even more mlb player prop picks